Oz here for YouTube and uh, darkstaraquatics.ning.com check us out it's a new website and I'm gonna go ahead and do this I might as well go ahead and check out our new well it's not really new I guess technically their site's older than ours but our uh, newly established sister website and that would be uh, aquascapes dot info I think it's just aquascapes dot info I don't think there's a dot com on the end uh, but uh, it's primarily a uh, it's primarily for European side of the uh, aquatics world um, at least this type of uh, stuff but I just want to show real quick this is going to be one of my last videos um, I'm getting a new camera uh, finally 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 gonna get a GoPro Hero 2 HD camera like 1080p it's got the little underwater shell to it so I can take underwater stills and video of plants and fish which I'm really looking forward to uh, as well as uh, doing some diving in the lake which most people are pretty fucking scared about uh, but I don't really care if it's gonna eat you, it's gonna eat you. There's nothing you can do about it. So whatever. But uh, yeah, man, this is uh, this is my old George Sage carpet, my five gallon. Uh, had a big old piece with knockers back there pulled up. A couple other little pieces in there, just from the water getting low. And this little filter is actually pretty strong. Um, but uh, this is gonna be one of my last videos that are shitty ass quality this little 480p camera is crap fucking hate it so without further ado um, I'll show the uh, the 10 gallon and 20 long and uh, then uh, I guess I'll go do another video of maybe the 29 and the 55 I really don't want to show the 29 right now because it's it's I've got an infestation of BBA and some other wild looking algae I've never even seen before. It's like orange and red and shit. So, uh, if you have T5 lighting, use a fucking timer because if you eyeball the shit, you're gonna get algae. So, there's no way around it. <coughs> Step over on my fucking motorcycle junk. I don't care. Yay. Cardinal plants floating around. Barely even shows up. So, new development. Right here. This shit going up, right? It's a pongeton. I had a bunch of bulbs floating around in here and they eventually root themselves. So, this one rooted itself right next to one of my pygmy chain swords. And, uh, the hygrophila in the back's getting pretty big just all of a sudden. So, still got some micro swords in here growing. Boy, this camera sucks. That's a micro sword, giant hair grass, bunch of pongetons, of course the pygmy chains in here, which are doing pretty good. And of course uh Jenna's giant Amazon sword, which I have got to send you. I've been oh I'm so you know, I'm in I'm such an asshole. I'm sorry. I am an asshole, but it's okay. I don't take any offense to it. I call myself an asshole because I am, it's true. Uh, if you disagree that I that I'm not an asshole, well fuck you, because I am an asshole. I enjoy it. <laughs> Whatever. Fuck it. So, here's a little 20 long. Looking good. It's always looking good. I started putting some kabamba in here. Just, you know, I took all the bow out of here and put it in 29. Took giant hair grass out, put it in 29. And the, uh, the clump, which was right here, you can't even tell now. I pulled about 50 of these pygmy chains out of this little clump about right here, right in the middle towards the back, right in front of the kabamba. Pulled about a big old handful, probably about 50, 60 stems. And it's all filled back in. You can barely tell, like you can barely see the substrate. That's where it's growing back in. So, it's pretty crazy. But uh, I did want to show on video, you know, a uh, few little things like my uh, Anubius growing driftwood. Some of this uh, crypt bronze windini. It's red windini, but it's all bronze. It's I don't have the 
Grape Crunch. Alright, Crips Morales in the back. Got one there. Got one over here. Mm, this tank's just real super simple. Got my drift, my uh, uh, almost said driftwood floating. What a fucking moron today. Jesus. Duckweed. At least I don't have a problem like I did last time. Call it dickweed. I got my dickweed floating around, you know? Son of a bitch, motherfucker. Anyway, so. Tank's looking good. Ten's looking all around. Five's looking good. Twenty nine looks like shit right now. Fifty five is good. All my fish are huge. I got a fire mouth that's about like that now. It went from like about an inch to about like this in about three months. Mm, I imagine that. I don't know. But anyway, I'm probably gonna take out this driftwood. Maybe put it in like the 55 or something, and I don't know. Might just pull all the Anubius off of it and sell it. I don't know. Um, it's got three pieces of Anubius on it. The bottom piece is about three inches long. Middle piece about an inch. And a little piece in the hole up there is probably like a quarter of an inch. But, I mean, it's got algae growing on it. It's a good season piece of driftwood. So if you want it, I'll, I will sell it. It ain't going to be cheap. Because I've had this Anubius growing on here for way over a year. So... If you want it though, let me know. All my plants are for sale. So, I mean, I got a, you know, a couple hundred pigment chainsaws here. Anybody want to hook up, I got you. But anyway, by the way, I'm not running a heater on this tank. 81.6 degrees Fahrenheit, don't need one. So, like I said, last video until the new camera gets here, which should be three to five days. So, bitching. I'm excited. So anyway, this is Oz, Mr. Chainsword. Yeah, that was gay. Anyway, uh, hit us up on darkstaraquatics.ning, N-I-N-G, dot com, as well as our sister website, aquascapes.info. And again, the aquascapes.info is the... Oh, but that's loud on video. I hope it is. I hope that blows out some eardrums, pisses a few people off. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. No, 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 no. You didn't see that. I'm just trying to electrocute my fish. Step the fuck off if you can't agree. Fuck. Anyway. This is Oz, Mr. Chainsaw for Fisher Aquatics YouTube, Darkstar, Aquatics.ning.com, and Aquascapes.info. Hit us up. Yo.